back off. Several armies there. Fuck you, night time. Oh, you better Nova me quick and get your allies there to help you out, because I'm a coming. Nova me, boy! Nova quick! Before all your allies help you out. What's that? You want some action, dear? Let's fucking get some action then. Oh, there's fucking loads of them. Well, that guy's teeping out, so now it's just red on his own. So come on, Orange, it's up to you. It's up to you to use those hawks. Use those hawks, Orange. Be the smart guy that we need on our team. Fuck you. Time to bring the hippos in for fun. It's red, so I want to keep red's attention and then just bombard him with hippos. Let's get this guy to go shims as well, so we have some decent... Oh, you're going to try that on me, are you? I don't think it works on me. Got to get the timing just right. <laughs> Funny. But like I say, I don't know if I'm actually making any real progress here. Despite all these multitude of hero kills, I'm still only level 3. And I haven't... I need to find red. Bump into red. That's what I want. With all these hippos. He needs to drop the ball, mess up. I need to sleep his he hero. And kill everything he's got. There's purple. But I need the mana fountain. That's on the other side. And they're going to go middle soon. So let's just be ready for that. There's red. Red's likely to TP to that. So let's get on that side. Let's see if he does. This guy's doing the wrong thing by having these hippos following his griffin because it shows that he's got the hippos there. You don't want to do that. You want him to think that it's safe to TP. But he's not going to TP because he knows it's not safe. Where are you, Red? Wow, that carrion swarm sucked. <laughs> that was terrible, that carrion swarm. Oh, they're TPing into that. Per Red's below, so I'm going down to Red. You can see that he was there, had some activity. So he's going to have all of his units there. Oh, he's TPing out, but he's only going to be TPing to his base, which looks like it must be here. So we've got to get this right, although he's got a lot of griffins, so even though I've got a lot of hippos, I'm still in a position where I can maybe hurt him. Here we go. Where are you? Did you TP? Oh, you clever sod. You didn't TP to your own base. Very clever. Where the fuck did you TP to? Over there. Ah... Well, those guys need to get back, because they're getting fucking analed. Such a shame. Just things needed to go my way a little bit more this game. As you can see, this whole game has basically been, thing, has been things not going my way. It's just been a whole multitude of that happening. I want to provoke t blue into TP and then kill with the f we uh, hippos if you see what I'm going for. They must have done middle. If not, they're going to be doing it in a middle, in a minute. Just see how redundant Dreadlord and Ghouls are. Uh, 
That's a lot of towers. But he'll be forced to respond to this. One of them will. These schools are so bad! Ah, oh my god, they're so bad. Let's team get some kills on your freaking units. Really? What are you gonna do, hippos? Are you gonna fucking attack him or not? Look how slow this truth lord is. Right, finally. Those hippos took a lot of beatings, but. Oh, this is bad. Guy's got some nice stuff though. VTP. Here we go. Get this guy to TP up on them, but wait for them to come in a little bit deeper. Oh, okay, they're TPing in. No one's there to help him out. Sleep the DK. DK doesn't get slept. He must have literally been like in the mid animation and then he teleported just before it went off. I'm waiting for this guy to find an excuse to TP on top of something. It just isn't there yet. Let's see if I can get Inferno Stone. I'm going to start playing with this guy now. All my ghouls are going to get absolutely... I can't really play with him though because all my... Jesus, this Dreadlord! Fucking hell! <laughs> it's so bad! Ghouls, so bad! Everything, so bad! I reckon this creep camp could actually slaughter all my ghouls. I'd actually have to try not to lose them. Really try. Look at these ghouls, look at their health. Look at them. So we have level 4 Dreadlord and a whole basic group of... I'm actually having to use sleep on this big guy, which isn't that effective. It's just beyond bad. I can't really go ghouls much anymore because this guy, I made him go mash... Oh wow, he's ghouls. Scroll of Resurrection, really? I might as well just use it. <laughs> Let's get a few extra ghouls. Oh my. Well, it's kicking off over here. Let's go. That is kicking off. Oh, this is going to be good if they don't all TP in time. Get those shims on that base. Because they won't be able to TP to that. That is harsh. I'm going to keep going ghouls, despite them being super bad. This blue guy is well and truly dead. Oh, get the DK before he TPs out, or maybe sleep him. I'm too far away to sleep. He's almost definitely going to use his teleport. That Dreadlord is just always too far away to fucking use his sleep. Good job, Orange. You're doing a nice job there, actually, to be honest. Well done. And Pink is just not dying. That's the main thing we ask of Pink right now. These shims are just amazingly awesome. Amazingly awesome. He's fully upgraded too. I'll leave one ghoul. Oh, actually no. We've got a lot of ghouls. More ghouls than I need hotkey groups for, to be honest. Speaking of which, I'll kill one of my ghouls. next base, hit it hard. He's going to go for the expansion by the looks of it. But yeah, the base... We should be able to kill that, even with... 
and they won't be able to TP in with all these shims. One of them might TP in, maybe two, but no, look, you'd have to start TPing now. The, the shims are just amazing. One might get to TP, one's going to get to TP, but then he's going to be on his own. Boom! Thank you and good night. No TP, let's sleep the Dark Ranger, that's the one with the TP. So make sure she's slept. And that's it. Oh, he bought a TP for his Keeper of the Grove by the looks of it. Oh, the Dark Ranger did manage to get a moment to get out of that and TP out, but that sleep certainly uh, helped a little bit to make him take a little bit extra damage. I'm tempted to TP up there. Dreadlord is ready. Oh, there's blue! There's my boy blue! There's my boy blue! My boy blue! My boy! <laughs> Long time no see, Blue. Long time no see. Well, have we got enough hippos? We're just going from base to base. I'm just going to leave like a ghoul in each base. Clear it out. There we go. So there's at least one ghoul. This guy can be finishing this off. That's fine. Just keep moving, keep working and working. Should be uh, Inferno time soon. Very soon. There it is. But I you can't just throw it out there, you need to try to time it for fun. It's fun to use there, to be honest. That's a good moment to use it. If I chuck it down there, that'd be lovely. Yeah, I'm the Fire Lord and the stuck Archmage. You can't get out from the right hand side because a big fat inferno was in the way. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. And that Dark Ranger is not going to hold up very long. She's trying though. Give her credit. Can I carry on? Sw oh, I wanted to chuck a carrion swarm. I was too far away in range anyway, but I just wanted to chuck down a carrion swarm to try and get the cheeky finishing kill. Never mind. Who's left? Is that it? Purple? That's the guy that just died pretty much, so I don't think he's going to want to stay in the game. <sighs> that was painful, wasn't it? <laughs> it was fun, but it was like all that hard work, and this happens countless times. You go Dreadlord and Ghouls, you can do the most amazing job, but you're still going to be fourth from the score. Nothing amazing, really. Because uh, Dreadlord and Ghouls only gets you so far. Anyway, thank you for watching. This has been Witty. Please subscribe, like, and comment. I'll see you later.